So I just dropped the Jeep off at uh, the Dodge dealership, which is right across the street, and uh, walk over here and open up our store. So hopefully having two keys to that vehicle and all the other vehicles we gotta get, it's gonna be a big benefit to everybody. So our toilets quit draining yesterday and come to find out the septic field at the shop here is frozen. Mining for gold on them TV shows, see? In there, yeah. Right down through the permafrost. Yeah, we're mining for black gold. <laughs> yeah. Brown gold. Frozen solid. That's what she frozen solid. Oh, yeah. So we got the big guns out here now, hoping to uh, thaw out that line. Hey, Randy. How you doing? Make us some headway? Well, I'm up there a few feet, but I'm at a fitting. So yeah. we go around the fitting kind of hard. See a couple of ice coming out every now and again. Yep. And thankfully, it doesn't smell too bad either. Well, hopefully, by the end of the day, we'll be able to use the bathroom again without having to go behind the barn or run home for something bigger. She's starting to smell ripe out here now. I guess it must have been. I haven't heard probably, so it must have been. Uh, I don't care. Okay, very good. Yep, thanks. Yep, mate. You sure know how to make her smell now, don't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah hopefully the neighbors don't complain there. <laughs> yeah, that's, yep. uh, well, see, that's all frozen under there, yep. so it's the only way to, it's going to take a while to seep away. But it is going away. Yeah, no, that's good. I just went down and dug a little trench at the end, but uh, it's just, that was Kenny there, so I just told him to put that together. Perfect. I don't want it to freeze again. <laughs> no, that's right. Appreciate okay. your help. Yeah, no problem. Uh, do you want the invoice to go through Penny, or do you want me to give you one? Oh, you can give us, give it to us if you want. Okay, I'll give yep. it to you. Right. So, yesterday ended kind of poopy, pardon the pun, and today we finished off with a makeshift septic system. That's going to get us through until spring. And uh, the problem was, is that the pipes froze coming out of the tanks and into the leach field. Could be because we drive on part of that section and it forced the frost down into the ground. But nevertheless, uh, we've got the problem fixed for now. We're able to use our toilets again. We don't have to go over there. So everything is good and we are getting ready for another six to eight inches of snow overnight. So with that being said, I'm going to sign off from here so we can go move some cars again and prepare ourselves for more crap. Again, pardon the pun.
here we are again at the intersection of King and Queen. First light cycle. So I promised I would keep you updated on the 36 Dodge project. So yesterday we sent it back over to A Plus Auto Glass, which is literally right next door to our shop. So dad drove it over and we've been looking at different designs for door panels. And there was a couple things that we want to take into consideration. And one of them is door speakers and how do you incorporate those or do you try and blend them in so you don't even know they're there. And one of the problems that we came up with was, you know, if you make curves and stuff like that, you set yourself back about 25 years in the hot rod business because you date the vehicle. So one of the things that we did was took a look through Google and, and images and different things of uh, what other people are doing and some of the styles that they're doing. And we found one that we settled on and we gave it to Danny and Sherry and they're going to put something together for us. And so what I'm gonna do now before I go back to the shop is I'm gonna stop in and see them and uh, just see how they're coming along and see what they're working on right now. And let's hope that they're okay with being a part of this YouTube channel. So we'll see. So there's, there's us over there. Hey. Hi. Can I scare you? Sneaking in. I just wanted to see how you guys are making out. Yeah. <laughs> you don't mind if you're on a YouTube video? Oh, definitely. Carry it on. Because we're tracking the progress of a car as we uh, as we go. Okay. Carry it on. So what are you doing now? Ah, getting the door glass in. Ah. Kind of fun. <laughs> so, what'd you think of the design that Dad brought over? Did you? Ah, uh... Uh, yeah. No, nope, that looked good. Yeah. Yeah, and I, we're we're gonna probably. I figure we make her a little wider at the back. Right. Like this, so we can get the because the handles don't line up. Right. They're in different different places. Yeah, the back one was up quite a bit higher. Yeah. And so, this one here, they're, they're so close together. Yeah. So, probably think it will probably come something like this. And then fan, fan it out a bit. Fan it out a bit. And then we can put that there. And then crunch this into it. And then we still got to figure out something down here for what we're going to do with the speakers. Yeah. Because now, I was telling them we're going to try, I'm going to try that wood. Uh, but there's, see how the door goes out? Yeah. Put a, put a gap here, so I'll be a I figure I get the glass in first and let's sit and we'll, we'll make templates for the door. I'm kind of thinking maybe just kind of the new around. That's okay. This rib is higher than this one. Yeah. That's gonna bring it in a little. But we'll try first. Just to see, see how much that bends. That's what they would have had first, just to the panel. Maybe it doesn't want that. Maybe it does just stop going to be a flat. Well, swell up and yeah. fall off is what it is. Yeah. Fall <laughs> we'll happen over but time. But then after 40 years. <clears throat> well, you know, yeah. and after, after 80 years. So. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Awesome.
Awesome stuff. So this is the stuff you're gonna make the panels out of here. Kind of a charcoal gray. I'm gonna go two tone with that in the black. All right, Danny. Well, I'll leave you alone. Now we'll we'll be over lots. Keeping an eye on things as far as uh, progress goes. Not that we don't trust you. Awesome. Nothing, okay. nothing to do with that at all. Exactly. <laughs> all right, we'll see ya. Have fun. See you later. So not a whole lot going on right at this moment. I mean, he's just getting the rest of the windows in, and uh, then we're gonna, he's gonna start puttering away with the material and the doors and getting the getting the design that we picked out settled in so we'll keep you updated for sure I just drove in here to work and for some reason our newly dug up septic field seems to have attracted some crows what's up with that yes we had another storm day the one we were supposed to get a couple days ago happened yesterday started around 34 o'clock ish and now I'm on my way to work to clean off Pickle. It is a cold one this morning. Minus nine. And it looks like we've turned into a body shop today. Dad's out here working on the fender, driver's side fender for the 36 Dodge. And Tim's out there doing rocker panels on a 2010 Cobalt. I think you found your calling, Tim. Yeah. Putting rocker panels on, cheap cars. Well, that one was all pre made, so. That no, makes it a little bit easier. Yeah. It wasn't made right, but this mm. bend here was in the wrong spot. We had to re bend it. Mm. Make it work. Yep. MacGyver. Remember. <laughs> Get her all welded up, sealed up, should be good to go. So you can see the rocker panel's done, and we got some rock guard on there, should protect it for a little while. Get this be sold. Yeah, at least once we get the uh, crack in the windshield fixed, which would be a new windshield on Monday. So if you know anyone looking for a 2010 Cobalt, probably somewhere around 39.95. 
So there you have it. It's Friday afternoon, another week done. And tomorrow we have another snowstorm coming. Only supposed to be a few inches, but it's supposed to turn to rain as well. So it could get a little messy. And we're gonna go home and enjoy the weekend anyways, regardless. My wife has been home sick most of this week. And uh, I'm uh, getting over a little bit of what she had. So we're about to go home, relax, grab something to eat and enjoy the weekend. If you like what you see, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're tuning in for the first time, please subscribe. Thanks. Have a great day.